Hello everybody and welcome to a new episode of Great Copy Aquatics. This is a DIY for a breather box. Hello, this is Lina. Today I want to show you how you can make more of your fryer survive by using a breather box. It's easy to make, so let me show you how it's done. One thing you should always remember is to make sure that you have a lot of plants, either live plants or plastic plants. This will give you a better success rate with all your fry. You also need some breeders. In this particular box I have chosen to have some platys. And I believe I have already found my first platy fry. Look. <laughs> And here is also a shot of the cleanup crew. What you need is a large box with some holes on the sides. You need some plastic mesh and you need a glue gun. Also a sharp stainless knife is very handy for this project. I would cut it like this so you leave a edge to attach the plastic mesh. Make sure to cut the mesh to the size you need and make sure to heat up your glue gun and attach the mesh to a clean and dry surface otherwise it will not stick to the inside of the breeder box. Here is the end result. You can see the mesh has been attached to the inside of the breeder box. I also attached some styrofoam to make it float. In this way the fry can now escape the breeder box and not be eaten by the adults. Thank you very much for watching my video. I hope you were inspired to make your own Brita box in the future. Please remember to like the video and subscribe if you want more free content like this. And remember to stay great.